We welcome you to story time, to story time, to story time. We welcome you to story time, so glad you came today. And we welcome all our friends. My name's Miss Rose from the Windsor Public Library. We have Bear in the chair ready for a story time. Let's wake up the sleepy bear. Here's the sleepy bear till it's nearly noon. Come, let's wake him with a happy tune. Oh, so still, is he ill? Shh, it's time to wake up the bear. So wake up, wake up, wake up, sleepy bear. Wake up, wake up, wake up, sleepy bear. Clap, little bear. Clap, clap, clap. It's time to read, little bear. So bear has a book for us. He's ready to look at The Big Bear, Small Mouse by Karma Wilson and Jane Chapman. Oh, there's the little mouse bear. Let's turn the page together. Big Bear, Small Mouse. Mouse hops on to Bear. He's careful not to fall. Bear is big, 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 and Mouse is small, small, small. Small Mouse, big Bear. Bear and Mouse both wave to their friends as they go past. Badger moseys slowly, but Hare runs fast. Slow badger, fast hare, small mouse, and big bear. Help bear, I need help. There we go. What's that up above? There's a flutter in the sky. Wren is flying low while owl is soaring high. There's a clatter in the glen. Hi owl, low wren. Where's the wren there? Can you see him? Way over there. Slow badger and fast hare. Small mouse and big bear. Mole and gopher tunnel up and join the happy crowd. The sun sets on the quiet woods, but all the friends are loud. Quiet woods, loud friends, high owl, low wren, slow badger, fast hare, small mouse, big bear. Raven flies down from the sky. Look, here comes the storm. Outside it's getting wet and cold, but the lair is nice and warm. All together, gathered there, cold night, warm lair, quiet woods, loud friends, high owl, low wren, slow badger, and fast hare, small mouse. And big bear. Thank you, bear. Another story with bear. If all the animals came inside by Eric Pinder, illustrated by Mark Brown, one of our favorites. If all the animals came inside, my brother would cry, my sister would hide, the doggie would bark, the kitten would hiss, my parents would make funny faces like this. But I wouldn't look for a place to hide. I'd climb aboard for an elephant ride. Thump, thump, bang, bump. The walls would tremble, the windows would shake. Oh, what a terrible mess this would make. When all the animals played hide and seek, I'd cover my eyes, but the monkeys would peek. They'd laugh, they'd point, they'd swing and they'd run. I'd hide with a hippo and have so much fun. Peek-a-poo. 
crash, bash, zoom, boom. The walls would tremble, the closets would quake. Oh, what a terrible mess we would make. When all the animals wanted a snack, the skunk and the panda and even the yak would rush to the kitchen and chew up our food. Mommy would tell them to stop being rude. Lunch, munch, burp, crunch. The walls would tremble, the dishes would break. Oh, what a terrible mess we would make. When all the animals needed a drink, they'd slobber and drool all over the sink. The badger would blubber, the grizzly would burp. My sister would mutter, oh, it's not nice to slurp. Phew, you, eek, ooh, the walls would tremble. The cupboards would shake. Oh, what a terrible mess we would make. The lions would roar as they sprawled on the floor. The lemurs would lollygag right by the door. My daddy would try to sit down in his chair. He'd holler and hoop with a porcupine there. Oh, wow! Ouch! Ouch! The walls would tremble. The sofa would break. Oh! What a terrible mess we would make. The gibbons would giggle, hyenas would laugh. The ostrich and I would go race the giraffe. We'd follow the bears as they ran up the stairs. We'd bounce on the beds and knock over the chairs. Rumble and jumble and pounce and bounce. The walls would tremble, the dressers would shake. Oh, what a terrible mess we would make. That's Monkeys are jumping on the bed. Oh, oh, they must bump their heads. Oh, bath time. My daddy would stammer and stare. You can't take a bath with an octopus there. The faucet would leak. The bathroom would flood. Daddy would slip and he'd land with a thud. Splash, splish, splash, slip, splat. The walls would tremble. The toilet would shake. Oh, what a terrible mess we would make. When all the animals wanted to play, they'd grab all my toys. They'd take them away. Upstairs and downstairs and out in the hall, the chipmunks would draw with my paint on the wall. Wibble, scribble, wipe and swipe. The walls would tremble. The crayons would break. Oh, what a terrible mess they would make. The bats would be dealing my cards on the ceiling. The squirrels would be squealing. The paint would be peeling. The rhinos downstairs would be watching TV. They'd stand in the way and leave no room for me. Spilling the popcorn and causing a riot, whooping and snorting, they'd never be quiet. Every last creature would sleep in my bed with oodles of pillows, one for each head. From sunset to sunrise, the wolves and the owls would keep us awake with their hooting and howls. We'd have nowhere to sleep, so we'd stretch and we'd yawn. We'd pack up our tent and go play on the lawn. As fun as a house full of critters would be, my dog and my kitten are plenty for me. The moon is round as round can be. Do you think? But oh, what a wild and wonderful ride when all the animals came inside.